Hello there guys, welcome in another tutorial. So this time we're gonna continue with blocking out the main figure of the human and hopefully on the next tutorial we're gonna attach our head to it. So let's crack on. Uh, here we finished uh, last time. So right now just gonna select those two faces. I'm gonna exclude those. And move it a bit, bit over here. Just rotate it a bit. Make sure you rotate just like that. Select the vertices. You can move those a bit up right now, and those ones as well. Look from this side. To round a bit more this one. Making sure all of those are more or less in the same line. Like this is fine. Go one more time over here. Select those two again. Extrude them again. Rotate them a bit. Just like that. And scale it down. Okay. Right now, let's select make them on the same line. Let's select those two. Extrude them. Select by mistake those two. Okay, select those two. Extrude them. Scale it down. Okay. Uh, I think we have a face over here. Okay. Try one more time. Set it out. Set it out. We don't need this. This one up, this part. Let's look from front. Okay, but now select all the edges. Extrude them. Move out. Scale them. Scale them a bit more. Just 
just like that. Extrude them again. Okay, set the edges. Let's do them again. Move them up. Okay. Leave it like this at the moment. Let's take our uh, arm. Scale it a bit. Extrude them. And we're going up to the middle part. Somewhere here. Rotate it a bit. Scale it. Make it match. We're gonna move it up to the to up to the end. Scale it. Make it match. Put in the face, just like this. Right now, what we need, we need to have a tool. tool. Like this, and we're gonna add one more. Some more here. Just like that. Right now, we can just take those vertices, put them in the place, and come back here, put those vertices. Move it a bit. This done, we can select those, those two. Again, right now, extrude this one, move it down, select those, move it a bit on the side. What we're gonna do now, we're gonna take one edge loop tool. Place it over here. You're not select both. Just in the beginning, maybe take this vertex, smooth it a bit. Okay, right now select this tool, extrude it, and take it to the end. Make it smaller. Move it, move it somewhere here. Okay. With this, we can take this one in. This one as well. Got to put it inside. Like this for now, it's, it's fine. You need to worry about this. Select those vertices, pull them in. Move 
Now we just need to have a look how we want to how we want to make it more or less like a cylinder cylinder shape. Okay. Have to pay attention that we just want to get a get shape of it. We don't really want to want to make details at this point. Okay. We're gonna do. We're gonna ex extrude those ones now. a bit, scale it, and leave it somewhere here, okay, I've done it fine, okay, at this point, I'm gonna take edge root tool, now move, like scale this part, come back to the edge loop, somewhere here, and scale it as well, now also, we need to do Put one over here. Just move it around. Scale it. Okay. Now we can get this side. Move this one. Scale it on the sides. Move this one as well. Focus on it. Okay. I don't want to select all, so I just want to select the vertices. Scale it. Select the vertices. Scale it. Move it a bit. Scale it. Bigger. Okay. So right now this one as well. Scale it. Remove it. Yeah, that's fine. This one scale it. And move it. Okay. This as well. Let's get it, move it. And now we can move those ones a, a bit back. This ones as well. And move those ones a bit forward. Okay. Okay, this one. Put it in a bit. What we're gonna do? I'm gonna select part of it, like those, those eight. Move it a bit closer. So move it a bit down. That's fine. Okay. So at this point. We have a, a main mesh um, done, like just basic geometry, really, really small uh, number of polygons. As you can see, we have just, we, we have like under 300 uh, basic mesh done. Okay, uh, on the next part, we, we're gonna attach head and try to make it fit and enhance.